Bangladesh is a land of potential. Crisscrossed with rivers, this fertile valley is blessed with natural resources and a youthful population determined to do their part to bolster the nation's growth. To ensure its development and economic growth, Bangladesh has been working hard to create an information and communication technology ICT enabling environment at all strata of the society. ICT is considered the driving force in achieving Vision 2021 and in transforming Bangladesh into a middle income country. For that reason, in 2009, the government formed the Digital Bangladesh Task Force to expand the use of ICT in every sector of society. The task is to build a modern, developed country with the introduction of ICT-based citizen services, e-commerce and e-governance and reducing poverty and creating employment through the expansion of a knowledge-based ICT industry. At present, the number of mobile users in Bangladesh has raised 100 million. Among them, more than 33 million are internet users. The foundation for development is set. As part of election manifesto of 2008, we promised the nation that we will set up, we will build Digitalized Bangladesh by 2021. And for that, we set up first a new division of a Minister of Science and Technology. Subsequently, we decided that a separate ministry with a separate minister would perform the bad job better. And our people have supported us, voted for us, with a view to achieve us achieving this simple objective to digitalize the country by 2021. In the course of fulfilling Vision 2021, as part of a basic ICT skill transfer program up to the Upazala level, a total of 192 computer labs have been established in schools and colleges to allow students to become acquainted with computer skills from an early age. Using the e-service center of the government, the Bangladesh Computer Council has established a data center to support hosting of digitized information content and services as one step in achieving the overall goal. At this time, the Bangladesh software industry has a global market of about 70.81 million US dollars. The growing pool of skilled and motivated English-speaking professionals and young ICT graduates has been the key driver of the rapid growth in Bangladesh IT and ITS. Low wage costs and low production costs in general are a major attraction for investment in the ICT industry in Bangladesh. Many ICT concerns in the country have collected major experience in working with foreign clients and investors. The availability of 3G connectivity means the industry is set to grow even further. The Bangladesh High Tech Park Authority commenced its journey with a view to provide a well-class business environment to multinational companies interested in investing their capital in the technology and software industry. The Bangladesh government has committed itself to facilitate this effort to create a favorable environment for foreign investors. High-tech parks are being developed in different parts of the country with the purpose of providing adequate infrastructure support services necessary to create the proper environment for the development of the IT industry. To that end, the Bangladesh High-tech Park Authority has taken a number of initiatives. They are providing support to the development of Kaliakoir High-tech Park at Kaliakoir Gazipur. They are establishing software technology parks at Joshur and at Jonathan Town in Karwan Bazar, Dhaka. They are establishing ICT incubators at Chittagong University of Engineering and Technology and at BDBL. They are also establishing IT villages at Mohakali, Dhaka, Russia and Silat and at the division level countrywide. The successful execution of these endeavors will allow the Bangladesh High Tech Park Authority to meet the vision of a digital Bangladesh. Kanyakur High Tech Park is the first state-level high-tech zone undertaken by the government and is a pioneer location opening to the outside world for investment on innovations. It is situated at Ghazipur alongside the 30 feet wide Dhakatangail Expressway on an area of 231.685 acres situated 40 km north from Dhaka city and 25 km from Shah Jalal International Airport. The latter serves as the access to railways in Dhaka and Tangai and the seaport at Chittagong. 
Chittagong is a major metropolitan area of Bangladesh. Located in the southeast, it is the country's principal seaport and an important industrial, financial and commercial hub. One of the fastest growing cities in the world, it has been eyed as a featured regional gateway and transit hub by India, China and others, including international investors. The country's first university-based incubator is going to be established at the campus of Chittagong University of Engineering and Technology, Tuet, Chittagong. The objective of the program is to promote entrepreneurship among IT graduates. The business incubator will also be helpful in bridging the gap between industries and academia and in fostering meaningful research and innovation. Joshur is in the southwest region of Bangladesh a major agricultural zone with international exports. 90% of land trade between India and Bangladesh takes place at the Joshua border. The Joshua Science and Technology University has been diligently producing skilled graduates for the country's IT sector. The Joshua Software Technology Park will be the national corridor for knowledge-based industries, providing an environment for software development, services, business processes, outsourcing and data centers. Rajshahi is a city in western Bangladesh called Silk City and Education City. Rajshahi has a varied history. The Rajshahi IT village is located in the heart of the city and surrounded by engineering universities and other educational institutions. It is planned to be an integrated township with state-of-art infrastructure for the IT and ITS and telecom industry and support for the crowdsourcing platform for freelancers. At present, 34 acres of land has been demarcated and a project has been undertaken to make it functional and operational for entrepreneurs and investors. Silet is a major urban center in northeast Bangladesh. It is a hub of the tea industry. The Silet Electronic City will be a world-class business center for local and foreign entrepreneurs, making it an ideal place for institutions of higher learning, research outfits and independent entrepreneurs to develop hiding industries and trade. To create a job market and integrate the young generation into the industry, a plan has been made to establish a high-tech STP park at the Company Gons Upajela. Initially about 162.83 acres land has been identified and another 236 acres of land is in the pipeline for acquirement. Bangladesh High Tech Park Authority has given so many of supports to all sorts of the entrepreneurs in Bangladesh. We are giving 10 years tax holiday and all the machineries they will import from the outside of the country an exemption of those import duties. This high-tech park authority will be the single window clearance so that the investor will not face any difficulties for getting any sorts of certificates from any parts of the country, giving them full support for establishing, for creating, for managing and for set up the new technological high-tech park in Bangladesh. These measures are all for one purpose, bring in foreign investment to boost the promising ICT industry. At present, in Bangladesh, a number of vibrant international companies including Microsoft, Dell, Sony, Samsung and Nokia are successfully operating their businesses. The opportunities present here have become visible the future of Bangladesh is here, where dreams are set to motion for a brighter tomorrow. Bangladesh High Tech Park Authority, the right ICT destination.